In this quick video, I want to introduce you to BoldGrid. BoldGrid for WordPress allows you to easily create websites in under 10 minutes, and it's really an amazing product. You've probably heard of BoldGrid and might think of it as just a page builder, but it's so much more. So in this video, then, I'm going to introduce you to the free parts of BoldGrid that will allow you to build an entire WordPress website without any code and in a ridiculously short amount of time. I'm here at boldgrid.com. You'll see the list of plugins are here. Some of them are free. Some of them aren't. Website templates and themes, literally able to build a website in just a few minutes. It's really crazy how simple this is. There are two ways to get started with BoldGrid. You can download it manually and install it on your own WordPress site, which we'll do in just a minute. Or you can click the Try It button and get your own setup in the cloud with WordPress and BoldGrid that is hosted there. In fact, you can even build it at BoldGrid, export it, and put it on your own site. A fantastic option if that's something you want to try. I'm going to hover over Support and click Getting Started with BoldGrid, and it all starts with downloading BoldGrid Inspirations. I'm going to click Get It Now. And as you can see, we've got the three main plugins here at the top. The Inspirations plugin, the Page and Post Editor plugin, and the SEO plugin. Another really fantastic plugin is the Backup plugin. It's also free. Some other fantastic plugins like WooCommerce. If you're building a WooCommerce store and you need to do it quickly and with no code, well then, BoldGrid and WooCommerce together. An amazing combination. I'm going to get the Inspirations plugin. It's just going to download it for me. I don't have to fill out any forms at all. I'm also going to get the Page and Post Editor plugin and the SEO plugin. Now I'm over here at a brand new, fresh installation of WordPress. There's absolutely nothing on here that doesn't come out of the box with WordPress. Click on Plugins and Add New. And I'm going to upload a plugin. When I install the BoldGrid Inspirations plugin, it's going to ask me for a connect key. And with BoldGrid, there's a pro version and a free version. So I don't have a connect key. I'm going to click there. I'm going to fill in my information and click Submit. They've just emailed the key to me, so I'm going to go grab that and paste it in. Agree to the terms of service. Paste that code in. And I'm good to go. BoldGrid Inspirations has been activated. I'm just going to add the other two plugins. When I click Add Plugin, BoldGrid is smart enough to know that I actually want to get the other BoldGrid plugins. So I'm going to install the Post and Page Builder. You'll notice there's a premium version of each of these. We're going to just stick with the free versions for this video. While that's doing that, a couple of really awesome thoughts. BoldGrid Staging allows you to stage your BoldGrid site while your old site is still up and running. What a helpful concept that is. Backup, one of the best backup options for WordPress bar none. It allows you to do everything you might want to do with a backup. I'm going to click Activate on the Post and Page Builder. Let's grab the SEO and activate that. All right, we've got our three main plugins ready to go. I'm going to build a site right in front of your eyes. So I'm going to head up to Inspirations. It's going to show me the free themes for all of the different categories. And remember, this is the free version of BoldGrid. And as we scroll down, you can see the really beautiful templates. In fact, these aren't just templates. These are entire websites. So I'm going to select Grid 1. We'll keep this one pretty simple. BoldGrid is going to grab that entire site for me. I'm going to click Next. It's going to ask me some optional information. Of course, I can fill in my phone number and address information. Click Next and install this website. Now, one thing to remember, this is going to replace your current WordPress site. So unless you have the staging server set up, it is going to completely erase your old content. Keep that in mind. So it's going to download all the assets I need and then set them up. Process only takes a few moments depending on your internet speed, but when you're done, you'll get the installation complete. 
If we click show on the log, you'll see all of the things that Bullgrid installed onto your new website. Clicking the Customize button then allows you to do what it sounds like, customize your new website. Now remember, this isn't just a page. It's an entire WordPress site that uses the WordPress customizer. So I can update the title, use a custom font, all of the things that the customizer can do for you. What about the individual pages? Well, this is where it gets really exciting. I'm going to go ahead over to Pages. I'm going to click on the About Us page and edit the page. And you'll see that Bullgrid has taken over the WordPress editing area. And now I can actually update the page just by typing in normal content. But you'll also notice that I have the ability to move sections around, edit sections, add images, and do all kinds of things just by clicking and controlling each element any way I want. I can add padding. I can even change the radius on a border. It's all that simple with Bold Grid. But what if I wanted another section? It's as easy as clicking Add Block. And now I have access to hundreds and hundreds of pre-designed blocks that I can just now click and drag. Let's say I wanted a strategy area or service area or a three column nicely laid out section. I can click and drag that and drop it anywhere I want in the bull grid space. I can delete it. I can do anything I want here. Now I can just click the check mark and come back and update it any way I want. So simply clicking and dragging makes all the difference in the world. I'm going to click Save way down here at the bottom. And you'll notice the easy SEO that Bullgrid installed is there as well. And I can't strongly recommend enough that you pay attention to that. What if I want to add a new page? Well, simple as this. Click a new page. I can actually get a quick start to my pages using the grid block sets. Bullgrid provides for me, and these are great. What if I want to create my own blocks? Well, down here at the Post and Page Builder, you have an entire block library. You can add new blocks. I'm able to create blocks and save them to be reused anywhere else on my site. Adding a block will help me create my pages faster. So I'm going to go ahead and add a block. It gives me a blank template to work from. And then, of course, all of the block types that Bullgrid provides. So I can just click and add it to the page. And I have a new block. Now I can edit that block, change the picture. Tell it where I want to focus on that to crop it to the right size. Update my text. I can add tags, custom fields, anything I want to the block. I can even continue to build it in the builder and create a complex block. If I go back to my library, there's my test block that I can now insert in a page anytime I want. This has been a quick intro to the very basics of Bullgrid. Don't forget, there's a whole lot more, including backups, image galleries, SEO, e-commerce, staging plugins, contact forms, and more. As I mentioned earlier, you can set up a WordPress site right here at Bullgrid, and it's probably the easiest way to get started in learning Bullgrid and seeing what it can do for you. As I mentioned, their pricing is exceptionally reasonable, and I'd encourage you to check it out at boldgrid.com.